Well, my name is Caleb Oaks. I am the CTO at Blue Margin. Uh, today, I'm going to walk through a quick report on employee utilization um, for a manufacturing company. Um, <clears throat> so let's get into it. When you first come to the report, you'll notice in the top left hand corner, uh, we have a company logo, a title of the page, some selected period information. So you know what date range you're looking at, uh, and then a last refresh date. Um, as you scroll across the top, there are some cards that indicate some of the larger aggregate numbers. And then you can see uh, all of the bar charts and graphs, uh, KPIs uh, that are all interactive. So for example, in the top left-hand visual, I'm gonna choose the lower assembly bar bay, lower assembly bay uh, column. Uh, and you can see that the report updates accordingly to what I clicked. If I click that again, it will reset the report to where I was at. We can also do things like clicking central packing area here in the right hand chart. And we can control click and choose multiple uh, areas. And you can see all of the other visuals update accordingly, everything from the other visuals on the page to the cards at the top. Lastly, that I want to show you is we can make a visual full screen. So this table of employee productivity on the bottom right hand corner where we see our different employees and how efficient they are, how much they're utilized, we can turn that to focus mode. Now we, with it full screen, we can really get a bead on who is underperforming and who we may need to take action on or focus on or um, figure out what's going on and why they haven't had the utilization that we expect. We can go back to the report uh, and choose a few other things. So we can adjust our dates in our filter pane over here on the right hand side. We'll choose July. After choosing the date, you can see everything update. Um, we've got more data in, in the report now. Um, we can also choose any of these other filters as well if we wanted to focus on an employee as we were looking um, at some of those lower performing employees in the utilization table. I'm going to do a quick sort so we see the bottom performing employees. So David's our lowest performing employee um, and we can choose him in our filter and see just data about him, uh, where he works, what the machine product productivity is, um, and a few other things related to him. Uh, there are many other pages that you can go to as part of this report, uh, but this is just a glimpse into employee utilization. In other pages that you get access to, you can view things like machine productivity, um, the shipping, productivity, on-time delivery, things like that. 